Debbie and welcome to my channel Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're doing a general reading, this short reading, for February 15th, 16th, and 17th, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, for Capricorns. Hello Capricorns and how are you today? Okay, I am using my Doreen Virtue Angel Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused with Reiki energy and this is a general reading. Take what you like, leave the rest. It may or may not apply to you. That's okay. Hope we have some fun with this too. But let's see what the energies are saying right now. We've gone through some sort of a little bit of a transit with Uranus and Mars. And that's, you know, that, that I think for Capricorns, it's going to be kind of that stressing up a little bit. I think that's why there's going to be that stress. Um, we were, you know, if you went to the 15th through the 28th, it's like, you know, the stress is going to be just a little bit up. It's nothing that you can't handle. Actually, I do feel like you, the energies that are coming now, I feel like you're going to be, um, in, I, I don't want to say invigorated, well, yeah, let's just say invigorated by it. It's kind of like you're challenged by it. And I, I see your brains, <laughs> I see your brains going a mile a minute with it. And it's like, okay, this is the situation. And I feel like the situation is caused by people around you. I don't feel like you're the instigator of your own story, okay? It's like they're the instigators. So maybe, you know, I'm, I'm hoping that this is just for the weekend, but I'm feeling like they're the instigators, but your mind is going, okay, if you do it that way, I'm going to do it this way. If you do it that way, I'm going to go that way. It's like you have, you know, you have all your, your plans in order, and it's almost like, I'm really feeling good about this, because the other reading, yesterday's reading, or the reading, you know, prior to this, your, your energy was really disconnecting with me, and I felt I feel like you've gotten yourself back into, um, not, I shouldn't say, like, it was the energies of around you were just so blah, 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 to you, but I feel like you now have the um, upper hand. It's like your upper hand is coming. And now I'm not saying that it's going to be easy. Please don't, you know, you know, life is not easy. But for my Capricorns, I feel like you've got that upper hand back again. And, you know, I have a lot, I have grown to have a lot of respect for Capricorns. I really, really have. And I don't, I, if people aren't respecting you, um, they really don't know. They don't know what they're missing about this. Because you can pull together I mean, you know, and again, I'm, you know, as, as it comes through my mouth, as it comes through my brain, um, and when I do this, I don't filter, so it's just coming right out. Um, I really feel that I lost it. No, um, I feel that you are the ones that will basically put people on a good pathway. They may not like their pathway, but you will put them on a good and what is right. You give them good advice. It's up to them whether they're not whether they're going to take it or not. I don't think that they always do take it, which is very frustrating, because it's kind of like um, you know you you see it so clearly for them, and then and actually and I don't think that they really know this about you. They actually it almost hurts you when it when you see their choices turn out badly. Okay. That wasn't quite what I was the message, but then I kind of derailed my own self. So it'll come back. It'll come back. If it's meant to be said, it will be said. Okay. Um, yeah, let's go ahead one more time. Let's cut. So those were just general musings from the muse. <laughs> For people that don't know, um, you know, I am a Chandler. So there's many times that, you know, that's why I show you the cards because the connections that I have with my subscribers, they know, they see the cards and they might say, okay, Deb, you know, I know where you're going with a lot of this. So I can see this card and the card is more for me than more my interpretation. I'm fine with that. And then I have other subscribers who come back and say, no, your interpretation was more correct for me. So it is something that we basically, we exchange our energies with. So, oh, and again too, you know, um, Love my subscribers, so please subscribe. I do pray for you. I do, um, you know, connect, asking my higher power, my divine, to watch over you and to bless you all. Okay, so three cards are down. First card is reversed. Let's see what this says. It's the Ten of Earth, your energy. You know, Earth is, of course, you know, this is the pentacles in traditional tarot. tarot. Money, money, money. Earth is what you can dig. 
Um, earth can be very, very um, giving, and it can also be very for, um, unforgiving, okay? So let's see what this one says. A very happy family life, financial security, finding magic in the little things of life or in life. And this is what we're going into the weekend with. So it looks like right now, um, I feel like you're going to have a little bit of money. And, you know, whether that be because you just got paid. And again, I felt, you know, I, I don't know if I said this. I didn't say this to, I think I said it to a subscriber in a comment. But I feel like you're going to get a little bit of money. I think Thursday, it might be that you find the 20 on the floor, you know, and you go, Ooh, you know, you and you will look around. You will look around to see if anyone lost it. And if anyone comes back and says, I lost my 20, that's the thing. You will say, here's your 20, okay? But I do feel that um, you're going to get, there's going to be like a little surprise of money for you. I really want that for you too. Okay, second card, the lovers, Archangel Raphael. And this is not... You know, I mean, this could be lovers between, you know, whenever I'm doing my readings, it's it's general. It could be career. It could be relationship. It could just be you, you know, just you at home type of thing. But this, so, you know, when I talk about the lovers, I'm really feeling like this is more your love for the people around you, okay? It's almost like your love is actually, you know, is, is, gotten bigger okay for this weekend things that m normally may have irritated you or may have you're going to look at it like that's just who that person is and you know what I, you know that's okay that's okay but let's read what this says intimate relationships carefully weigh your decisions good health and that does go along with our ten of earth you know the the family the happy family financial security magic in the little things of life I do feel though when I when I see the angel cards, and that's why I really love using the angel cards because I really have a strong belief in angels. I do the divine's messengers, okay, and that they have jobs to do. You know, they're given their jobs like we have our jobs, and I really feel that this is going to be a weekend that you are going to actually be able to relax and rejoice. Relax and rejoice keeps coming comes to my mind. Okay, so let's see what this next card comes up as. The Four of Earth, again, your energy. Being too frivolous or too cautious with money, good business decisions, giving to those less fortunate. And, you know, so yes, so there's going to be something with money. Again, I'm feeling that thing that there's going to be a little bit extra money. And it'll be dependent on you if you want to spend it, if you don't want to spend it. There's nothing wrong with putting some money in the bank put, or putting all the money in the bank, you know. And there's nothing wrong with taking a little bit out and spending. You are going to be, you know, I'm feeling like this is actually going to be, maybe somebody's paying off a car loan or some type of loan. You know, it's like all of a sudden there's going to be extra money. And that I like. And when there's extra money, you're going to be able to take that extra money and possibly, um, you know, share, share it with the ones that you love and, you know, um, you know, share it with the ones that you love. I find, I feel like gifts or I feel like, um, you know, you, you, you don't necessarily, you're not like um, some other signs that need to have the credit. Not to say that you shouldn't have the credit because you really should have it, but it's not like you do things for the credit, okay? So I feel like you're going to be giving, um, you're going to be like benevolence. It's going to be benevolence, and it's going to be because this is the cycle. Now, again, go to the 15th to the, 8th, the 28th because there is going to be some stressors. But this weekend itself, I really, I'm feeling like we're going into this 15th as if, you know, it, it's like, and maybe it's because you, you know, you're more aware of what the energies are going to be, but I really feel that the weekend going into the 15th for my Capricorns, you're going to, you're, you're going to just, it's going to be kind of like that, you know, that one card that comes in and says, you have to buckle down, but it's like, you're already doing that. And you're already saying, I like better times. I can, but I can weather the not better times. And because of that, you're taking that energy and you're actually working that energy through for you. Okay. I hope that make, makes sense um, because it, it's almost like you are so much more aware of things and now since you're aware of it you can work within it okay okay i think that that's that's really the best thing that i can say but for the weekend oh 
I did. I prayed. I prayed and said, oh, please, please, please give me some good stuff for Capricorns. And then it just came over to me. It's like you just, Capricorns, it was like you just, you know, I know I've said reset before for some of the signs, and it's not that you've reset, but it's like you just said, okay, again, what I'm, I'm going to repeat, repeat, I'm going to repeat myself. It's like, no, I know that these are going to be, this is the circumstances, this is what's going around me, but I can work with that. I can make those things, I can go through those things. Okay? Okay. <sighs> so Capricorns, I'm very happy. I'm, this is a good reading. I'm happy you're going to go into the weekend. I really feel strength from you. Okay. So as always, Capricorns, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.